Alrighty, amigos. I'm Dave from AdventureAmigos.net, and I am back. Night. This is actually two nights later now. Um, and I'm going to attempt. I'm not going to attempt. We're going to freaking do it. Um, we're going balls to the walls tonight in Wick. I know I kind of um, punked out the other night on the first video. So I am back to redeem myself here with a fine mug of Anchor California Lager and the general will to survive Wick. We're gonna see how far we get. I got jumped by some little bastard kid the last time if you watched the first video. If you didn't, please go to our YouTube channel and uh, check it out. But I got stabbed to death by some little kid in a mask. Um, but we're gonna see how long we can last tonight. So, without further ado, and I spilled beer down my chin, let's do this thing. Um, we're gonna hit continue. And uh, we're in this to win this, suckers. Um, please, by the way, go to adventuremigos.net. Uh, go to facebook.com slash adventuremigos2. That's the number two. And uh, give us a like. We're almost to a thousand. So, when, previously on Wick. So, the whole general thing is here that um, there's a game called Wick that kids play. Um, you know, about some missing kids in the woods that can only be seen by candlelight and shit. Blah, 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 blah. And <laughs> I'm acting like this is all child's play when I... Basically, got scared shitless and had to had to quit. But I, I had a valid excuse. My daughter started crying, and it was just like yeah, this I've heard the story. Weird, no, it's true. Tricks. It was a long. T anyway, we're gonna skip all this. We already know what happens. Watch the first video. But she started crying, and like I, it just created this weird atmosphere in the house, man. And I was just like, nah, I can't do this. Nope, not gonna do it. So when we last previously on Wick, when we last met, we figured out that um, we gotta pick up this candle. And we know that um, the candle doesn't really do shit other than to let you see these little bastards flying around to scare the hell out of you. But uh, very creepy. I, I'm, a, I have a little, I'm a little more courageous tonight, so we'll see what happens. Waiting for the first jump scare, because you know what's going to happen. Um, hopefully it doesn't get me as badly as the first time. I, I, I literally jumped out of my seat on that one. But... Um, Okay, we were at that fireplace. I think there was a candle in there before. Yeah. It's not there now. It's a little unsettling. Um, as I said, this is one of those games where you just really don't know what's coming. And as you can see, my candle is slowly burning down, so you want to find new candles. And, um, you know, you want to do that thing. So I'm not going to really edit this video. I'm already, like, squinting, like, something's going to jump out of nowhere. It's getting the hell out of me. Uh, there's a bridge. That's new. And you can run in this game, which served me well the first time. But if you guys caught that earlier video, let's swap out candles here. Let's swap candles. Oh, oh, shoot. I forgot you gotta, you gotta light it from the other one first. Then you can take the new candle. And cross the bridge. <laughs> Hi. Dave from Adventure Amigos. Mm, that sons of bitches. Well, anyway, as I was saying while during while we were crossing the bridge, that um I don't even know, I don't even know what the hell I was saying. <laughs> I don't know what the point of this game is. I still don't. Um, I did see a screenshot. I cheated a little bit. I looked. Oh shit! Run, 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 run. Okay. I think we've sort of established that it's like Slenderman and the fact that if I don't look at them, they cannot kill me. I don't know if that's true. I'm making that up. You do have stamina because you obviously, as you saw, I ran out of stamina. I couldn't run anymore. Okay, let's make, we're on a mission. We're gonna head towards that, that flashing light that you guys just saw, but we're gonna stay on the path because the path just seems safe. God, that, they're like little ninja masked serial killer bastard children that jump out of the, like, what are you doing? Oh shit. Sorry, if you have kids in the room, it's a good time to teach them about the woods here. And not to go play Wick in the forest. Or play a game about Wick that takes place in the forest. My candle's dying. I need to find another count. This is where I got greased on the last video. So if that little kid pops out in the same place, I'm out. 
Oh shoot, I am out of candle, man. I need a candle, I need a candle bad. Okay, light it, light it, can we light it? Light it, I'm pressing the button. Oh, there we go, oh. I'm not a religious man, but thank the Lord Almighty on high, the Lord of hosts, that I have a candle. Okay, shit. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's another candle. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Okay, so, um, um, uh, he's right behind me. Nothing I can do but run, I don't think. I don't have like a machete. If I could get, if I go to Harbor Freight and get one of those $3.99 machetes, I'm talking $3.99, like they literally have full on machetes at Winco for $3.99. Everybody's talking about like guns right now. Machetes are the real danger, man. When anyone could go to a go to a store and buy a machete for three dollars and ninety cents. Okay, that's our mission. We're heading towards that light. I'm saving my stamina just in case one of these little rat bastards drops out of a tree. Okay, there it is. There it is. Oh, it's a candle. Okay, well that's good to know. I guess that's good to know that. Okay, there's another house. Oh, oh, there's that fireplace. I'm walking around in a big circle. Ah, oh, I should have swapped out my candle while I was there. But I'm sitting here. I'm sitting here bullshitting. Okay, what's this? Okay, we're gonna swap out candles. So I'm just kind of like, I'm afraid to look up. Ugh. What? That had to have been something. I'm not turning around. I'm not turning around. Something's walking out there. I can hear it. God damn it. Okay, we gotta figure out a point here. I'm, I'm sure you guys are getting frustrated. With it. Oh, what is that noise? Why? Why do they do that? I gotta admit, I am a little less scared now. Unless something totally new happens. I'm, I'm over the kids dropping. I'm over the kids dropping out of the trees. Like this is, you know, Co Kevin Costner's Robin Hood. <laughs> He's like, hello, cousin. I really want to see... Okay, there's that bus. That's the bus that I walk... That's the... I'm hearing stuff. I don't have my speakers that loud because I don't want it to interfere with what the mic picks up, but... Maybe you guys hear something I know. I don't want to go on this bus because I went on it last video. Although there is a candle. And I had, like, an acid trip and I ended up somewhere else, but I need that candle. It's totally possible that I am going to run out of candles if I just keep wandering around. Oh, man. Okay, camp. That's a good sign. But which way? This way? Oh, that's a gate. That's the gate. Am I back to where? No, I'm not back to where I started from. I don't think. But, oh, I need to drink a beer, but I'm afraid to stop. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get ballsy here. I'm gonna get a drink. Mm -hmm. Beer almost left the nose and mouth. What the hell, man? Sons of bitches. All right, you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna just, I'm not quitting. I'm not gonna quit until I either figure something out or I get stabbed again. I'm not quitting. Uh. Uh. Private property? Wait, someone actually lives up there? What are they, like a thousand years old? Here's two bucks for a new padlock. Can I go now? 1 a.m. Archives reveal old pioneer site within woods. Homestead burned down in 1924. Family listed as dead, but children's bodies never located. Field officer interviews local resident. News archive and photograph entered into evidence. Where are you, Josh? Best part about Blair Witch is when they're sitting in the car and he's like, fucking lens had meters. That is the greatest part. Okay, like, new level? Well, first thing you always do is you pick up the candle. Yeah, say it like Scott Staff. Okay, I pick up the candle. We're gonna take this creepy photograph. Stay away from her. No shit. Okay, did I drop? Oh. It's in. Jeez. Oh, jeez. I don't know why I had a lisp like that when I'm scared. Oh, 
level two is scarier than level one. If I'm if I'm correct in saying that. Fudge factory, dude. That sounded like it was over here, like in a completely different layer of space, man. I don't, you guys probably hear stuff that I can't, but there are like weird sounds. I don't have surround sound on this PC, but my speakers are pretty good. I don't, know, I don't really like talking about bragging on my speakers, but it does sound like there's things going on behind me and around me. Maybe I'm just tripping. Whoa. Just took my hand off the mouse and my. Headshot for the sky. Am I back to that stupid fireplace? I must be. I am. Okay, well, let's go back that way then, because that seemed like a, a newer area. You have got to be shitting me right now. I've entered the twilight zone. The picture of man playing Wick in the forest. He's had too much beer, and he just ran out of candlelight. God bless America. You've, you're kidding me right now. Okay, I have no candle, so we're gonna do what we know, and we're gonna head for that flashing, flashing light because that we we think that's a candle. Okay. Oh God. Oh oh no. What just happened? That's how they throw you off. These little dicks. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, almighty. Sorry for you religious fans out there. God bless the United States during the Cold War. All right. For all the love of Pete, there's a candle. Light that shit. Good Lord. <laughs> I'm not running. I'm not running. I ain't afraid of no ghost. There's something following me. I'm not turning around. I'm not turning around for shit. That's it. We're gonna do this. You know, my grandfather was in World War II. I will not run from a video game. What? It's like the clock tower. Save the clock tower. I tend to talk more when I get nervous. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Oh, shit! is nuts! Run, 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 run for your life. Run from the little boy with the scary mask. You ever see that movie, uh, Leslie Vernon? Like, story of a serial killer? So I'm, I'm, I'm screwing up the name, but I... It looks like the mask from that movie. Okay, someone out there, give me a hint. What the hell am I supposed to be doing? Because at a point, I, I will probably tire of the jump scares, but it, it's, well, I didn't I see you. Oh, really? I didn't see a graveyard before. That's kind of new. What's this? There's a book. Unlocked Dude, evidence. If this shit's true, and what you found out is real, then our channel is going to blow up. That can finally be our ticket out of this show. Run. When the music gets like that, you run. Okay. So. Yeah, I gotta say, amigos, I'm. I'm actually not that scared anymore, other than the fact that I'll jump if something, obviously, flashes onto the screen. At this point... At this point... <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm totally fine. At this point, I just don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm, I'm kind of wandering aimlessly in the dark. My candles keep going out. I need to find some... I need to find, a, like, what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm trying to find a goal here. Well, oh, there's that thing that I'm not supposed to look at. That which we don't speak of. Okay. So far, so good. That's So pretty much when you see something dangerous, you just turn the other way and run. I was all wrong about this game. Maybe it's not so bad. 
I do want to just find a candle, just for the sake of having a candle. Oh, fudge! Fudge pack. Is that appropriate to say? I mean, if you, you know, are employed by the C's Chocolate Company, it's very likely and plausible that a job description within the C's Company is a fudge packer. I'm just throwing that out there. I mean, I don't... I don't want to get into semantics here, but there's a candle. Here. Oh, I thought that tree was a person. All right. No, not the Twilight Zone. Unless it's pertinent to the story. Ah, oh, come on. I was right in front of that candle and it Twilight Zone to my ass. For brevity, I might have to shorten this video. I mean, I just don't want to. Oh, shit. I don't want to keep wandering around in the woods. I'm getting chased. I think I'm gonna die. Maybe not. They cannot kill what does not look at them. So, yeah, like I said. And it seems like at times I can jump using the space bar, but it's not working now. Uh, like I said, it... it oh, shit. That, that, pretty soon I'm just going to get tired of running away from these guys, and I'm going to... Um, another... We were on our way back home, and we totally heard someone. Totally! Like somebody sleeping. Snoring like a mother trucker. He said mother trucker. 2 a.m. Local campers report sounds of someone sleeping and loud snoring. Suggest subjects will st were still alive and present in the woods at this time. Interview logged. Area map entered in evidence. So I'm guessing time is progressing. It's now 2 o'clock in the morning. And I'm guessing that I'm just... My whole point here is to stay alive or, or keep walking around. I mean, this map's not very big, I don't think. Pick up the candle. No. You can't relight a lit candle. Or can you? Put the match away! What? What's this? Look away. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. I'm still... I'm guessing there's the bridge. Let's go under the bridge. This is where the magic happens. Whoa. That was like a thud. That was like someone threw a body. God! Spoke to Judas. give this game one thing it has going for it so far. The jump scares are legit. I mean, I'm... They usually... Uh, I don't know. After one... You know, you've seen a couple jump scares. You've seen them all. This game's keeping them fresh. Alright, there's a little... There's a little glimmer of hope. Let's go that way. No, don't put the candle down. Noob shit. As I said, this video is probably a strong PG-13. Remember? Okay, that's it. Now I'm out of candle. My screen's glitching. I might die. <laughs> Holy sh... They're getting, they're getting creative with these jump scares. I'll give you that. That much. I mean, pretty much if I just stay in a straight line and walk in one direction, I'm bound to A, get jump scared, and B, uh, maybe find a wall? I don't know. Man, light that. Light your candle. So we're just gonna keep, let's just walk in directions now. That, that's the new until the next time increment passes. That's the new goal here. Not 
looking that way. Not, why would I look in the direction of... It's like rule number one of Wick. Do not look in the direction that you hear sounds. <laughs> That's my game fact. If you, if you want to know how to beat Wick or get through Wick, at least so far. I think I was just in a weird mood the other night, and I, I was not ready to put, to get into this. So, tonight I'm just like, now I'm kind of frustrated more than anything. I know some kid's going to either jump, run, or fart in front of me, and I'm going to get scared. But after that... What? What? Nothing. Exactly. This forest is out of tricks. Okay. Hello! I'm here! I'm right here! I throw my candle down like, fuck you! Now it's a... It's a different... Different story when you run out of candle power. I... I have a bad feeling about this one because I... I know that I've gotten most... Jesus H! Oh god. No way. No way. No, 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 no. No. I'm Dave with AdventureAmigos.net. I think that's as much wick as you need to see for a... What is today? Monday? A Monday night? Mm-hmm. It's like Monday night football. Monday night wick. Take care.